What's that noise? There's aliens. I think I think they're talking about you. Hi right, everybody, it's Wolfang. Yes, I'm playing around. So I said I was gonna make another recording today. Or video, not a recording. What the hell? Anyway, uh, <clears throat> this is something else I found earlier today about uh, alien bodies that the government supposedly has. So let me share this article and read it to you. U.S. in possession of a variety of at least 10 alien bodies. Whistleblower claims. Guess this was posted 11 hours ago. Story by Paul Donald. Anyway, it says it has been claimed by a former intelligence officer that the U.S. government has a number of alien bodies stashed away, which are, which were retrieved from crashed UFOs. David Krush, if I'm saying his name right, an Air Force veteran, recently made the claims on the Joe Rogan show and also alleged there may have been some form of interaction with the extraterrestrial beings. I hope it wasn't sexual. Mr. Krush said that the podcast that the government has a variety of alien bodies, but the total numbers of what's interacting with us on Earth, I mean, nobody knows that, he added. <laughs> he continued, I talked to people who are familiar with a biological analysis and everything. So we have some idea, not a complete picture, because it's like, you know, you're looking at it, mm, it's the mm, mm, e, ah. <laughs> well, I don't even understand the psych, uh, psychology at all. It's like, what the heck? It's way different. Well, if you got alien bodies, it's, yeah, it's going to be way different. Come on, dude. Mr. Cruz, Crutch, whatever, served as a member of the National Geos... Geospatial Intelligent Agency, or known as NGA, and the National Reconnaissance Office, NRO, but has admitted that he had not seen firsthand evidence, keyword evidence, of the alleged extraterrestrial craft or bodies. Earlier this year, he had testified before the U.S. Congress during a hearing about the existence of aliens, claiming that he had given proof of the U.S. government's possession of alien bodies to Congress and the Inspector General of the Intelligence Community, or ICIG, as part of of a whistleblower complaint. So he's complaining we have alien bodies and the government's not sharing it. So maybe that's what one of the aliens look like. Going home. Remember E.T.? Crouch had earlier said that when he submitted classified information about alien vehicles to the U.S. Congress, he suffered retaliation from government officials. After a 14-year career 
and U.S. intelligence, Crouch left the government in April 2023. This latest claim comes after a slew of reported sightings of UFOs in 2022. The Pentagon held first public hearing on UFOs in 50 years. Krush earlier told the House Oversight Subcommittee that the government has participated in a sanctioned UFO crash retrieval program for decades with officers who are trained to detect, retrieve, and even reverse engineer space, spacecraft technology. Now let's go back to that. With officers who are trained to detect, retrieve, and reverse engineer. So how are they training these officers to do this stuff if they don't know that UFOs even exist? Anyway, but the Pentagon is continuing to deny all knowledge of such matters. Now, that's the, what is it, the, the gray alien? There's white aliens. Because remember, you can't be racist with aliens. So, he said then, I was informed in the course of my official duties of a multi-decade UAP crash retrieval and reverse engineering program to which I was denied access. When the committee asked Croach whether he thought the government was in possession of UAPs, unidentified aerial phenomena, he answered, absolutely, based on interviewing over 40 witnesses over four years. I know the exact locations. The former military man claims that he has knowledge of individuals being hurt in a project that was attempting to reverse engineer an alien spacecraft and said that they would be willing to testify in a secure setting. Kruch also testified that a massive cover-up was ongoing, and any military personnel attempting to talk about aliens or extraterrestrial phenomena were met with brutal retaliation. He told the subcommittee, I do have knowledge of active, planned, reciprocal activity against myself and other colleagues. So there you go, folks. An alien put my cigarette out. So I don't know. You tell me. Is it a hoax? Is it real? Do you think our government really has uh, 10 alien varieties? Of bodies? I don't know. I will say this. That wasn't me. <laughs> oh, come on. It's Saturday. I'm just having fun. But no, really. Um, as vast as the universe is, I think there's something else out there. And all the new reports coming in. That's what they say. So, this is Wolf Fang with your alien report on a Saturday night. Blessed be. Stay safe. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.